Mario and friends kept up their search, delving ever deeper into the mansion. Wherever they looked, though, they found no sign of Merle. Where was this mysterious woman? Ah, maybe this way, said so said Tippy, trying to sense the pure heart's location. With dread dangling like a broken chandelier, our heroes hurried through corridors. Why would we be dreading a mansion? It's a house. It's not even a creepy house. This is chapter 2-3, Breaking the Bank. Alright, hey guys and gals, I'm Pal, and welcome back to Super Paper Mario! Last time! We... it was actually kind of a short episode. I don't... No, why? Um, it, stuff happened, and it wasn't much. We entered the mansion, and that's like it. So this time, uh, that's that's a vase. Um, let's go through this door because I kind of want to avoid the vase. Oh, hey, it's what's her? What was her name? Mimi? Yeah, it was Mimi. What's in here? Um, nothing. All right. <laughs> See you, room. See you later, room. Let's go away from the room and jump. No. I said we'll jump up on here. Oh, and break that. Okay. Okay. I see how it is. Mario, you couldn't have, like, prevented that, man. You broke it. You broke my most favorite his vase. Why did you leave it on a block that's meant to be hit? Doofuses. I love that vase more than anything, and you broke it. Yeah. Oh, you'll pay for that? Yes, you will. I'll have you know that that vase cost one million rubies. So hand over that money now or you're done for. R rubies? I don't believe Mario carries any of that particular currency. I don't suppose that they're the those are anything like coins, are they? Coins? No one uses coins anymore, you peasants. I spit on your coins. So... So what are you saying? Are you are you telling me you don't have enough rubies at all? Well, guess what? You're just gonna have to work it off then. Until you work off your debt, you naughty little things, I own you. Enjoy labor. Yes. So, if you earn enough rubies in the generator room on the top floor, once you earn enough, uh, you earn one million rubies, you can pay it off in the room in the back. You can also check the balance of your debt there. So, get to work, servants. Mario is now saddled with a 1 million ruby, uh, sorry. Mario is now saddled with a 1 million Poco debt. Whoa! We have to pay it off. And sadly, we can't just get random, like, I couldn't just grab this clock and call it good. We actually have to work for a living, and we don't have Pikmin to back us up. So, let's get to work? Um, okay. I guess I'm gonna have to work? I, I really don't know. Once again, this game is blind for me, and while I watched the Let's Play, I don't remember everything. Hello, Pharaoh with a whip. Um, um, looking for some pep? Gra then grab a mushroom and get your energy back up. Just bash that block there to produce a suspicious or delicious mushroom. Each one costs 10 rubies, mind you, but that's how I make my living, so eat up! Uh, wow. Okay. Mmm, juicy! Eating mushrooms is the only pleasure allowed in this horrible factory. I don't know if I could ever go on without my sweet little fungi. Okay. Wait, is he a reference to, like, the slim mushroom that was, was a developer thing that made Mario tall and slim? I don't know. Hey, new gerbil. You want to learn a, a little secret? Yeah, I bet you do. Just let me ten a hundred rubies. I'll tell you something good. Honest, it's prime info. I don't have that money, so no. What, you don't trust me? Pfft, you must lead a sad little gerbil life if you can't trust people. Okay. Um, I guess we're gonna have to pull a Moses and kill one of the guards? Maybe? Because <laughs> they have whips and they're like Pharaoh, which is an obvious parallel. And I'm... <laughs> I have a dress and I have a, a parasol, so like... The, the parallel is clearly drawn here. Oh. Okay. Jump, little fleas! Work those skinny little flea legs! Mm, make it burn! Jump like you mean it! Boss Mimi hates the dark like she hates Brussels sprouts, so work it! More power! What are we watching? Um, 
Home improvement? Okay, so... Um... Can we hit this? Yes? Will it generate things for us? Why aren't we getting rubies? Wait, I'm gonna talk to this guy. What, what happened? To yeah, this generator room, hit blocks, make earn rubies. Um, yeah, yes, I do. Love the energy jump like you mean it. Another day, another ruby. Their, their love, their life. Once you're done jumping, talk to me. Okay, let's see how many I earn here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, how many, how many did I earn? Like ten? Fifty? Um, I got ten. So, if I jump a million times, I can make mad money. All right, that seems easy enough. Kappa. Okay, let's let's go through here because there has to be a better way. There has to be a better way than destroying my remote. What is this? Enter passcode. Okay, so there's a passcode. Uh, let's switch to Mario. Talk to you. I came to get my romantic fortune read, okay? You know, see the future for me and my gal? But I never let met Merlee, and now I'll never see my sweetie again. Cruel fate! I, I meant- I think he meant to say dramatic irony! Okay, what's- what's in here? There has to be a better way, like, there really does. New flea, huh? Hey, did you know there's a VIP room as well as the normal one? You can earn rubies there way faster than the entry-level flea jumping room. Here's the problem, though. You need a passcode to get in, and only members know it. Man, if only I knew that passcode. Okay. Juicy info. I got it. Want it? I'll tell you for one ruby. Uh, sure, I have one. Here's the skinny. In this mansion, there are lots of hidden passageways. Yeah. Check all walls. Check both sides. Up, down, left, right. Leave no corner unchecked. Okay, I needed to be doing that, because I haven't been. That's a good tip. I work and work, but can't get, uh, get enough rubies to pay off my debt. I gotta tell you, I don't know if I'm ever gonna get out of this creepy place. It's not creepy, but okay. Uh, see- Ooh, hey. Hey, buddy. Fine timing, friend of mine. I just got hold of some very delectable, delectable info. You're timely, so it's yours. I was gonna charge 10,001 rubies, but for you, 10,000. Sound good? Uh, I don't have that money. Pfft. You know what you are? Friend of mine? Cheap! Take a hike. Okay, I will. There's nothing secret in this room, so either he was lying, or he offered information for one ruby, not really making a profit. Ah, and he was telling the truth. He was. He was telling the truth. Thank you, man. There's a secret passageway. What is up here? There's another gerbil. Hey, buddy. Sniff, sniff, sniff. I smell rubies up ahead and lots of them. But see those electrified barriers? They'll turn you into a roast gr uh, gerbil surprise. If only I had me one of them slenderizing pixels I heard about. You heard of them? If you use one of them, you can turn sideways, which makes you practically invisible. And think there's one of them things stashed somewhere in this mansion. Also good info, okay. Um, I feel like that would be in a secret passageway. So let's keep looking around. Because there has to be a way. For me to not- Ah! There's a hit- There's a false wall here, or rather a wall- that is obviously false. What is in here? What's what is this? There's a card, a boo card. Not what I wanted. All right, where do I go? Um, I really want to figure this out on camera because because like this is game is blind and I want to know. Uh, I've been in there. I've been in in 3D. Let's switch over to Peach because there there really has to be a better way. What is in here? Because I, I am hard pressed to find a way that's better than jumping like a gerbil. Um, did I transform here or switch? No, there's nothing here. All right, I feel like the answer is with that guy right there that wants he wants 100 rubies for some info. So I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to meet his demand because the guy that wants 10,000, that's that's just insane and he's crazy. Okay, I've been there before. Uh, let's go in here and then flip. Okay, flip. Wow, there, there are a lot of these blocks. Okay. Um, but nothing... Nothing really... Nothing really to see. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety. One, two, three, ow. Four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, one hundred. All right, so I gave up and just decided to hit this thing one hundred times because then I can pay that guy's info. I think that's where it's at. So, well, fine. For your utterly average work, here's your average sum of rubies. You got 101 rubies. Okay, so I miscounted, but that's fine. Let's just go over here and go pay that guy's uh, that guy's fee for getting a tip. Let's see, what room was it? Was that in, um... That was down here, wasn't it? That was in this room right over here. Uh, flip. Peach. Nice. Jump. Got it. Room. Because the... Otherwise, otherwise, I would have to do that one million times, and that's that's absurd. Hey, new gerbil, you want to hear a little secret? Yes, here you go. Your mom taught you to trust strangers, huh? Yeah, solid parenting right there. Well, turns out she was a smart cookie. I'm going to give you the VIP room passcode. I knew it. The secret code is 5963. What good is it? That's a secret. Duh. Just remember 5963, gerbil. Thank me later. Okay, so 5963. 5963. 5963. 59 guys 63 what was it it was 59 63 59 63 59 63 what is it I I just said it it's five nine six what what it was five nine sixty three what did I get wrong I don't know what I got wrong please enter all right let's go in here and I have the VIP right so I get I get things faster? Run, gerbils! Round and round and round she goes. When I'll retire, nobody knows. Big boss Mimi hates the dark more than old ham, so move those gerbil legs. Power up! Alright, so this seems more manageable. Uh, Peach, you shouldn't be doing the work, honey. You, you're you still recovering from spicy soup. So, this is the VIP room. Generator, runner, wheel, and make volts. Earn some cash. What's, <laughs> what's volts? Yeah, major upgrade from that other room. You'll earn crazy rubies in here. Ugh. So, a new gerbil, huh? Hungry for rubies, gerbil? You want to work here? Yes. Great, great. Just hang on for one more, one more second for me. Move, gerbils, move! You know, sometimes I wonder why I do this. But it's simple. Work is fun. You ready? Yes. Good answer. Now get in there, gerbil. Move. All right, so let's jump in, and we can just run. Okay, that that's that's easy. Um, is there a way to do this easily though? Just hold down. No, I thought I could just use Super Mario uh, Bros. No, like new Super Mario Bros. physics and just slide, but no, I can't do that. Okay, so let's see. This is easy. But I don't want to hold the remote this whole time, so let's find a way to hold this thing down. Aw, what's the matter? Tuckered out little gerbil. You n no, I, I really didn't spend any effort on that at all. Woo, you're just a little scamper, aren't you? That's what I call a can-do gerbil. You ought to try out for the annu annual germ gerbil Olympics? Gerbil Olympics, you know? You could win medals. We reward scampering like that around here. Come here for your payoff, super gerbil. Cool. <laughs> Though it really required no effort. I uh I set my controller upside down with a USB mouse receiver on the D-pad <laughs> so it was pushing down um right and then I set just set something heavy on my controller which in this case was my wallet. Here. You got uh uh-huh. Wait a minute. No way. No, no way. I set that on. Okay. Okay. I did that for about 10 minutes. There has to be another way. Actually, yeah, yeah, there was. There was a, uh, there was a guy somewhere around here that would, that was selling information for 10,000. So let's do that. Hey, buddy, buddy, was it you? New flea, huh? There's a VIP room. Way faster. Um. Okay, not you. There's hidden passageways. And there's another guy in here? Yeah. Was it you? Fine timing friend of mine, I got hold of some very delectable info. You're timely, so it's yours. I'll charge 10,000 for it. Yes, that sounds good. Thanks, buddy of mine, because actually, 
you could you could get up to a million doing what I was doing but it would take probably hours so I'm not gonna do that that's more effort than I want to do setting my my heavy wallet on top of my uh, my remote listen and listen good M Mimi was napping okay and I heard her start sleep talking and she whispered Oh boy, I won't be able to remember that. Um, four one two six two eight one six. How does that help me? Uh, let me write this down though, because that's important. Um, notes. Man, iPods are awesome. Um, compose. Okay. Four one two six six two. Um, eight one six eight one. Six. Okay. Is that it? Thinks her boyfriend's phone number or something? I don't know. But it cost me 10,000, so it had better be good. But I, I can't think about what that would be. Wait, wait. How many digits is that? That's that's a lot. Okay, I, I thought for a moment like we had to have that amount of rubies, but no. And this is this one's a four-digit code. What? do we do for that um let's go down here because I haven't been here in a while that's odd that's really odd um oh hi there big welcome have have you do the thing um no huh I don't maybe it's a no it's not a code in the, it wouldn't be a code in the uh, the electric jumping room and it can't be a code here because I've gone in here before I actually don't remember the code. Um, it was 5963 or something like that? Yeah. It's not here. Is it something to do with... With the secret place? Really specific? Wait a, wait a minute. Wait a minute. You see that down there? There's another secret place. Oh, snap. I've been in that one. I've been in the one that right up here. But I have not been in the one down there. No, I don't want a bomb. I want Peach. Peach, get over here. There's a secret place. Switch back. Is that the key? Please be the key. Ah, wait. Wait a minute. Hey, buddy. You know the secret? Okay. Because I do. Wow, we, we're really just reeling in the pixels. So, do you know the secret part? Well, do ya? If in you close your peepers and imagine real hard that the world's gone, why, it's just about the biggest darn thrill ever. Uh huh? My senses are telling me that you're the hero. Wow, welcome, Pard. What is Pard? I don't know what Pard is. Got some bad news, though. Looks to me that you're a bit lacking in thrills. I can't give my power to anyone who's too skinny in the thrills department. So, here's what I, we do, Pard. I'll recharge your thrill gauge over the next 10 seconds. You ready? Here goes. One, two, three, five, four, seventeen, three point one four, one marzillion, ten! Now you're all chargified, pard! Oh, it's partner, that's what it's short for, for. Yipper, you got your thrills. Now remember, we pixels got loads of power. So you best be real careful with us. We had a little dust up with them ancients 2,000 years ago, but we're pards now. So let's have some thrills, huh? Come on. Okay. The sideways turning pixel named Slim is now your part. You can use Slim's power to turn sideways and avoid traps or enemies. And when you're sideways, you won't take damage as long as you stay still. Okay, so now you know the secret, huh, part, don't you? Playing hide and seek is the biggest thrill you can find. You ought to try it. Okay. So, now I can turn... S wait, wait, wait a minute. Okay. I noticed, th I noticed this, and I was going to mention it a while back, but technically, 
if you want to be go to 3D, you could just do this because you're turning sideways just like this does. But Slim is literally the most useless power-up in the world. Because, okay, we have one that grabs things, okay? Sure, we're accounting for our own laziness so we don't have to grab items. Then we have one that places bombs. A little bit more useful, sure, sure. But then we have one that may gives us 3D but with a 2D camera view. Like, how? That's not useful. I mean, maybe it's useful, but it's not useful. Uh, it's painful. I mean, it's not painful that we can absorb or we can avoid these traps, but still, I mean, ah. Uh, okay. Well, I actually did everything right here, it seems. And also, there's no, re there's no drawback to just walking around like this all the time except that I can't okay I can't interact with things enter passcode let's see we got this right it is four one two six six two eight six oh wait wait a minute two eight one six what um four one two six six two eight yeah, two, eight, one, uh, what? Did I, I didn't enter one wrong, did, oh, no. Four, one, two, two, oh, wait, no, no, wait, two, six, six, um, two, eight. Oh, boy. Okay, I'm guessing that the six, that there's only one six, and I just put that in wrong. Okay, um, six, two, eight, one, six, this better be right. Okay, good. I was worried there. Also, there are only three numbers showing. <gasps> okay. <laughs> oh. Okay, that's nice. Okay, we got we got the thrills now. Um, they're all yours, my friend, as long as you have enough rubies. All right. Uh, we got the powers. All right, let's run through here. I have no clue what hitting those lasers would do, but I'm a bit scared to find out. I'm finding out. Okay, we take we take one damage, really? Okay. So we'll take just one damage from those things. Alright, let's jump down. We have we have a million rubies. We've we've achieved our goal. We have paid off Tom Nook. We have we have saved stinking Hokatate. A Hokatate. We are the best champion. We've solved the debt. We we have 100 percent completion on New LA. We We've achieved it. I'm I'm running out of metaphors for debt. We paid off the United States, what is it, 13 trillion dollar debt. I'm so proud of us. Oh hi there, big wel welcome. So happy to have you here at Ruby Savings and Loan. Huh? You thought it would never happen. First off, thanks for helping out, take for taking out a special Ruby loan. Now, what can I do for you? Um, I'm gonna pay off my thing. Super. Let me just take all those rubies off your hands. There you go. Ha. Ah. Ah. Ha. Ah. Ha. We, we achieved it. Well, thank you so much for paying off your ruby loan debt in f fall. What? How did you earn enough rubies to pay it off? That's not supposed to happen. No. You've broken my wonderful curse. Yeah. I'll get you. Yeah. Uh. Uh. uh she just blew up. This. So, that young imp put a curse on this mansion then. But who was she really? I'm worried about Merli. We must hurry to her aid. And we'll do that next episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like. And if you didn't, then drop a comment telling me how I could make the next episode so that you would like it. I release new episodes of Super Paper Mario Tuesdays and Thursdays. Saturdays are periodically ABOs. How do I get through this? Um, oh, okay. I just do this. Got it. And I'll see you guys next time for another Pal Plays Super Paper Mario. That was fun. And also completely blind. And I did it. See you guys then! End of chapter!